Okay, first card out, we have legal issues, court judges, immigrations, lawyers, ETC. So somebody could be going through legal issues at this time. Um, this is also giving me the justice card. Things about to be balanced out. Yeah, there was some type of injustice done to this connection. Mm -mm. Somebody could be praying that things balance out between you guys. I'm also hearing like somebody, this person could be wanting to give you your flowers. Maybe this person didn't appreciate you before. Give me more Holy Spirit. Yeah, we have drama starter and unbothered player. Somebody could have been having someone in the energy that was just like, you know, starting a lot of drama. <clears throat> or maybe you felt like this person, whoever they were surrounded by sunseeds, there was a lot of drama, chaos around them. So you just separated yourself. Maybe you know that this person um is going through a lot or just got a lot going on around them in the energy, whoever this player is. Mm -hmm. And I feel like you're very unbothered at this time. <clears throat> Not that you don't care. It's just that you could just know that this person got a lot of drama in their life right now. Somebody could be a spiritual hater. Hates on your spirituality, light, magic, and power. Whoever this stalker is. <clears throat> Give me more Holy Spirit. Player. Player. Whoever the player is, they're a spiritual hater. Mm -hmm. This player hates on your spirituality, your light, your magic, and your power. Give me a card on the um, Unbothered Holy Spirit. Unbothered. Unbothered. Yeah, girl fight. What the hell? Hmm. This could have been somebody who was very aggressive to you, Sunseeds. Mm -hmm. Somebody could have been um, competing with you. Um, just, you could have felt like this person was real problematic. <clears throat> yeah, idol, love, respected, admired, idolized, and fan. Yeah, because I heard somebody could be wanting to give you your flowers now. Whoever this person that was hating on your spirituality. But with the running, it looked like you out of there. Yeah, because you unbothered. And somebody is crying over you. You could have definitely walked away from this energy. Yeah, rejected. Somebody feels rejected by you. Okay. This person could be waiting on you to return, come back. <clears throat> this person could have, with this drama started, this person could have tried to find somebody new, but nobody compares to you. Yeah, this person could have tried to replace you, find somebody else because they was hating on your spirituality, your beliefs, whatever you believe in. And only to realize that they got into somebody that they feel like is just like, mm -mm, they full of drama. They don't want to be bothered. Somebody does not want to be bothered. <clears throat> What's this drama starter? It's giving me somebody wants you to trust them again. Is somebody wants to come in and balance the skills out. Yeah, creeping and fake flexing. So this person is definitely creeping. Uh, whoever this drama starter is, is creeping. This could have been somebody saying that she was fake flexing, talking about you. Okay, yeah, this is somebody who holds and holding a grudge against you. Mm-hmm. But well, this could have been in the past. We, you know, we're going to see later. But yeah, this is somebody who's always partying. Or this is somebody who could have had a party lifestyle. This is somebody who holds a grudge against you. You know, creeping and spying. This could have been somebody, like I said, they were just, you know, out here fake flexing. But this also, I feel like with the drama started, somebody was saying that she was fake flexing. You know? Oh, you don't got it. You don't, you don't got this. You don't have that, you know? And you just over here unbothered, minding your damn business while all of this conflict going on. And I feel like you separated yourself. You with the running and item and um, idolize like you you don't have to prove nothing to nobody mm -mm. you got the hell on yeah low iq and nightmares whoever this person is okay that's slow as hell okay it's having nightmares um paranoia anxiety unable to sleep okay um yeah look queen rising and shepherd look 
You that's why you got the hell out of there. <laughs> you ran. Okay, Queen Rising, stepping into your power praise, coming up in the spotlight, tripping on you. Somebody is definitely tripping on you. Mm hmm Yeah, this is somebody who be out here fake, flexing, clout hungry. I'm hearing, um, you know, do everything for social media. Yeah, but this person is receiving some type of bad karma. I said bad karma. They're receiving some type of bad karma. Yeah, bankruptcy. Yeah, some it's given somebody was trying to project their energy. They're the fake flexor. <laughs> okay? They're the fake flexor. They're the ones who's um the wolves that she pulled and they're the ones who ain't got a pot to piss out a window to throw it the hell out. And they hold a, a grudge against you because you the real deal. Now they crying over you because you decided to move on. Okay, this person could be looking you up. They feel like you're moving in silence. Maybe you don't be around. Maybe this person haven't talked to you. <clears throat> But with the legal issues, this is somebody who's going through a lot of a lot of problems when it comes to the legal um, the legal um, system. But I also feel like intuitive things are being balanced out. It's given like the justice card. So this person is receiving karma. If this person talked about you, started drama about you, lied about you, um, you know, hating on your spirituality, it's like now everything that somebody was trying to um, you know perceive that you were. People are seeing this person as that. They see them as a creep. They see them as a fake flexor. They see them as a drama starter. They see them as a hater. This is the one who holds a grudge against you. Okay. This is somebody who always, you know, partying. Okay. Always under the fluence. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, they just tripping on you. Whoever this low ass person is. <clears throat> yeah, this person plays a lot of games. Okay. Yeah, love on the brain and stalker. This person got you on the brain heavily. Mm -hmm. This is somebody who stalks you, fishes in your comments. Okay. If you're on social media in any type of way, this person is fishing in your comments. Okay. Yeah, shine. Your light irritates this, this person's demons. That's why they spread all of these rumors. And that's why the justice card out here with this legal issue because things are being balanced out. Yeah. Who I, I'm telling you, broke ass talking shit. I cannot make it up. People are seeing this person as a broke ass and they just talking shit because they hating on you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, fed up. Yeah, this, if this cyber bullying, wow. So this person could have been definitely cyber bullying you online, but they're getting fed up now. Yeah, they're getting fed up <clears throat> because that karma is hitting them. Mm-hmm. That karma is hitting them. And here you go. Look at you. Unfazed, unbothered. Because, yeah, you like same shit, different day. Like, you just numb to the, you just numb to it now. Yeah, you know, same shit, just a different day. Okay, this person is definitely having some type of nightmares. <clears throat> this person definitely could have left you out in the cold and just started talking about you. And this is somebody who you could have definitely trusted. Hmm. I'm hearing now this person wants you back. What's the drama starter energy, Holy Spirit? Drama starter. Thank you. Yeah, love triangle. <clears throat> this is somebody definitely who put you in a third party situation. <clears throat> Had other lovers, possibly multiple lovers, whoever this player is that was hating on your spirituality. Yeah. <clears throat> See, this person, you know, this person, you know, went somewhere else or tried to like reject you or talk bad about you because they knew with you being a spiritual person you will be able to see right through them see the other these other people go fool them but you can see right through them it was easy it was easy for you to see right through them so this person started hating on you spreading lies about you to make you look bad to others because you knew the truth about them yeah love triangle i've been seeing someone else and i'm having trouble choosing so whoever this drama star is, they've been they saying and they've been seeing someone else and they've been having trouble choosing. I'm gonna try to hurry up and get this reading out because the garbage truck just came. <clears throat> so with that garbage truck being there, um <clears throat> you definitely took the trash out. You just just with that um idolizing and running, you got the hell up out of there. You see this person as trash. Or you just knew this person was trash talking to, talking you. Thank you, Spirit. We got another haunted car. This person is haunted by the nightmares. I'm haunted by my decisions. 
I'm haunted by my decisions and the memories we made together. I feel like this was someone you trusted, Sunsees, but they at their breaking point now. Yeah, they are. Because all that drama that they started, look, Spirit said can't be trusted. All that drama that they started about you is now going right back. People are seeing this person for everything they try to perceive you as. Legal issues is giving me the justice card. Things are being balanced out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like these people don't even want to hear this person out. They know that this person is a hater. Mm -hmm. What's the creeping, Holy Spirit? Creeping? They could have got a team up. Uh, uh, they could have got um, their family members, their friends, uh, uh, a bunch of people to team up on you and talk a bunch of stuff about you. Creeping is playing power with trust your intuition. Spirit is saying trust your intuition. You know this person creeping, Sunseeds. You know this person creeping. Oh, that's you could have definitely trust your intuition. That's why you got the hell of a um got up out of there. Yeah, this person who's overthinking now, they don't want to they don't want you to lose hope in this connection. What's the grudge holder, Holy Spirit? Grudge holder. Grudge holder is clarified with competition. I get intimidated and nervous knowing you get so much attention. So whoever this person is that's holding a grudge against you. Um, they get intimidated and nervous knowing that you get a lot of attention. This person was a hater the whole entire time. <clears throat> oh, child. Wow, the fact is being exposed. Okay, this person holds a grudge against you because you get so much attention. They don't like the fact that people support you, people love you, um, people care about you. They don't like that. So this person wanted to start like, you know, drama in your life, conflict. Yeah, this person out here fake flexing and lying, hating on your spirituality, this is not nice. What's the girl fight, argument, physical fight, competing, what's the girl fight? You know what, Spirit, I'm not playing. Girl fight is playing fire with jealousy. They were jealous the whole time. I get jealous when I think of anyone else having you and stealing you away. Mm -mm -mm. This is why, if, this, if you were dealing with a person that was very aggressive, like anything you say to this person, they just get real loud and rowdy. And it's like, if you try to ask them anything, Sunsea, they just get so defensive. Like, this was somebody that was like, a grown man or a grown woman taking how it resonate. That little girl, that little boy in them was just scared of them really, you know, losing you or feeling like they would ever have to compete between, you know, someone else when it comes to you. Because this person always knew your work, the sun sees. Something about this person's mind was not right. I don't even want to say where the, um, it was somewhere. I seen low IQ, but it's something about their mind was not right. They get jealous when they think of you with anyone else. They feel like... They feel like they would have to compete now. They feel like it's not just them anymore. Ooh, child. Somebody is desperate. Who wow. Play out here twice. Player and desperate. Yeah. Now they want to apologize. It's something about this person's mind. Like, it was like, oh, man. This is somebody who literally could have tried to come for your character, your reputation, and everything, spreading lies and rumors about you, all because they was jealous. What's this fake flex of Holy Spirit? Excuse, um, that garbage truck, so Steve. Fake flex. Thank you, Spirit. Fake flex is clear if I were haunted. I'm haunted by my decision and the memories we made together. Mm-hmm. They being haunted because they lied. They lied. <clears throat> on someone who was the um, queen rising, who's being idolized, somebody who divine holds in high regards, now they're being haunted. Because people are seeing them for who they are. They were just a hater the whole time. Was this always partying, Holy Spirit? They was jealous. Wow. Always partying. Always partying. Divorced. So this could have been somebody you was married to, or this could have just been someone that you decided to separate from. I'm ending my long-term relationship to be with you. For some of you guys, this person was definitely married to someone else. 
This person definitely put you in a third party situation with the love triangle. So you take it how it resonates. You could have been married to this person and you got a divorce or you found out that this person had you in a, a, a love triangle with somebody who they was in a commitment with for a long time. Okay. Yeah. Let them go. You was divinely guided to let this person go. Mm hmm. This person is saying, I'm ending my long-term relationship to be with you. So this person is ending out a long-term relationship with um with someone who they was with for a long time to be with you. It could be it could be a lot of drama, it could be a lot of arguments and fights because this person could be knowing that this person wants to be with you or come towards you. Give me a card in the play, Holy Spirit. Not the right time. So something wasn't the right time. Yeah. Reconciliation. Now that this person has left this long-term relationship or walking away, now they want to come in and reconcile with you because before was not the right time. We have divine union and unfazed. So some of you guys can notice your divine counterpart, but you're unfazed. You don't, you're unbothered. Some of you guys notice your divine counterpart and you're still not moved by it because you felt like with the with the legal issues, like I said, they gave me the justice card. There was some type of injustice done to you. You felt like things weren't fair. The way how they treated you, for one, somebody lied and put you in a third-party situation that you was unaware of, and to the moment you found out and you got the hell up out of there, okay? Because I know I'm talking to my empress or my empress, and then you don't do third parties. Ain't no way in hell you going to do a third party, okay? For others of you guys, it, it, it not only did they, they put you in a love triangle, but then they kicked your back in. Because you, whoever you are, uh, I feel like people see you a certain way, you know? So they this person didn't want people to get on their back like, oh, why you do that to such and such? Or why you do that to such and such? Like, I know such and such, they this type of person, they this type of person. So what they did was they made you out to be the bad guy, made you out to be the bad guy or the bad woman so they wouldn't be perceived a certain way. But it backfired. It backfired. Mm-hmm. This person feels like um, you're worth waiting for. What's the spiritual hater, Holy Spirit? Spiritual hater. Spiritual hater. Spiritual hater is clarified what difference is. This person, it says maybe we are just too different to make the relationship work. But okay, so because of your spirituality, because of your beliefs, this person felt like um, this relationship was too difficult, so seems to, you know, to make it work. But this person is saying, I choose you. I'm sorry for taking so long to realize it's always been you. Yeah, this because of whatever you believe in, okay, this person felt like um, you guys were just too different. It would be too difficult to make this connection work. Online dating. So this person could be someone who, um, you know, hooks up on a lot of, um, you know, um, online um, hook up with people online. You could have met this person online. Um, you could have noticed something online about this person. It says, I have a few love interests online. Nothing serious, just casual flirting. So this is somebody who flirts a lot online, okay? So this don't even have to necessarily mean somebody just hooking up with people. They just flirt a lot online. Always liking people's pictures, you know, just... Um, very attentive when it comes to like sexy photos of people. They just always flirting. This is somebody that just, you would think that they could be in a whole committed relationship, but the way how they come off and move in life, you would think, you know, they move like they single. They do what the hell they want to do. I made up my, my mind and I'm not wasting any more time. Yeah. This was somebody who just, just do what they want to do. Yeah. Commitment. When I think about my future, I see you. This was somebody who felt like they needed to explore their options. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. But this person can't move on from you. Ooh. Wow. It says pushing buttons. I do things to trigger you. It's the only way I know you care. This, is, uh, this person is real different. That's why I came out with low IQ real different it says push your buttons i do things to trigger you it's the only way i know you care so this person could be like purposely um make it to where you find out about them dealing with somebody else or a fling or them flirting and just to get a reaction out of you 
because they feel like that that's the only way you show you care. Because who I'm talking to, you too grown. You ain't got time for that these baby ray ass games. You don't got time for that for that childish stuff. Okay, this is somebody that needs to grow up, and they do things to get your attention. But it's it's like starting drama, starting fights and chaos. Who needs that? Who needs that? You know, life is already hard sometimes. When you're dealing with your mate, you know, after you're done working or taking care of your family, you want to be able to feel comfort, you know, at peace with your mate. Who the hell want to fight with their partner? Because they so jealous, son, sees, they get so intimidated by you about, because you get all this attention, they feel like they got to make you jealous to trigger you. That's not healthy. Can't move on. I can't move on no matter how hard I try. Look at this. They can't move on, son, see. They can't. Somebody needs to grow up. I feel like they might be older in age, but mentally with that low IQ, mm -mm, no, they're not. Okay? Unsent messages. I've written you several texts, but in the end, I chicken out. So this person writes you a lot of messages, but but instead of them hitting the send button, they, they chicken out. This person can self-please um, to your pictures. <clears throat> Let's see, let's see. Oh, child. What's the legal issues for the spirit? The legal issues. And it was all because of your light irritated their demons. It's like whoever this person is that was talking shit about you, okay, this is somebody who who really wants to have you. They want to be with you. But the way they do it is weird. What's the legal issues, Holy Spirit? Legal issues? Oh. So we have the hangman. Pisces energy. <clears throat> Knight of Swords. Seven of Cups, the Death card in reverse. <clears throat> so this is somebody who doesn't want something to end with you guys. Uh -uh. This is somebody who fear of you, you know, having a new beginning, you moving forward. This is somebody who don't want to lose you. Uh -uh. They don't. No, 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 no. This is somebody who's stuck on you. They feel like, they feel like you're too important for them to lose, son, these. This person fear of you having a new beginning, okay? But this is somebody who's always repeating patterns of, of being negative or doing negative things. This is somebody who who constantly was was resist. This was somebody who was constantly resisting change. You could have constantly told this person like, "You need to change. You need to do this." You know why are you acting out like that? You know. Why are you acting out like that? We better than that, you know? You because I feel like earlier I, I picked up you trusted this person. You couldn't you, you you probably shocked to know this person acted out like that. They came for you like that. Yeah. But this is somebody who feels feels stuck on you. They they, they don't wanna they don't wanna see you move on. Mm -mm. If this person they hold a grudge against you, but they don't want to release you. Mm. Yeah, give me more Holy Spirit. Two major arcanas, the first two cards out. Somebody is scared that something is over. One and two, breaking down to a three. One and three, breaking down to a four, which is seven. Three and four is seven. Yeah, it's like somebody does not want, they don't they don't want something to be over the death card in reverse. It's like somebody blames somebody for being mature. Somebody blames somebody for being beautiful. Somebody blames somebody for being handsome. Somebody blames somebody for getting a lot of attention. Somebody blames somebody for being loved. Somebody blames somebody for being respected. Like, damn. Yeah, this person need to get their mind right. Give me more of the spirit. Hopefully they did. Yeah, the sun card in reverse. Leo energy. This person is not happy. 
They're not happy. This person is sad. Mm-hmm. Ooh, child. Give me more Holy Spirit. Let me get this card. This was somebody who was pretending that, oh, I'm happy, I'm fine, I'm all of these things now that I'm not, now, no, 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 no. Yes, yeah, seven of wands in reverse. Mm-mm. Folding. This is somebody who's, who's, it's like whatever pack y'all had, whatever, because I heard earlier you trusted this person. It's like, this person started folding on you, like, you like, damn, why you switch up, you know? Why you switch up like this? Ooh, child. It's like it's giving me an energy of where somebody, you know, with the spiritual hater, it's like somebody pretended that they supported, you know, your spirituality only to come to find out that they was hating on it the whole time. Ooh, child. Can I have a card on the hangman, Holy Spirit? Hangman. Seven of Swords. This person was very deceitful. They was a liar. They, I, I, I feel like they held back the fact that they never supported just your, your, your beliefs. They never supported your beliefs. You know, they made fun of them. They mocked them behind your back. They talked about you. Possibly to some of you guys, to whoever these other lovers is that they had you to love triangle with. They didn't support you. They was very dishonest. This person betrayed like they was for you, but they was really a hidden enemy. This somebody who stalks you, spies on you. This person's a whole creep. Well, what's the death card in reverse, Holy Spirit? I feel like somebody is definitely really crying like a damn baby now. Like something is given. What? This deck is not even in reverse. The world card in reverse. Wow. This is somebody that was trying to keep you stuck and stagnated. This is somebody who wouldn't want you to complete out a cycle with them. They wanted you to stay right here. Even though there was a secret enemy, even though they wasn't happy for you with the sun card in reverse, um, even though they was lying on you, even though they were starting drama behind your back, it's like, I still didn't want to lose you because I see you as my ten of cups, ten of cups to the emperor. I see you as my complete, I, I see you as my, um, you know, my complete fulfillment. I, I, I feel, I feel like I can have the family with you, you know, whenever I'm ready. Cause I feel like you're worth waiting for. And with the ten of cups to the emperor, I feel like this is somebody who you didn't give up on easily. You, it's like you could, you could have gave this person up to damn 10, 10 tries. <laughs> like, you know, it's not funny, but you could have gave this person like a lot of tries with the, with the 10 of cups being here. Three of wands before you turned your back. Yeah, it's in a judgment. I feel like you ain't just give up easily. You gave this person a lot of tries until you just, you know, you see this person for who they were. You wasn't going to keep, you know, painting the picture, you know, when somebody is showing you who they are. What's the sun card in reverse? Page of cups. Now this person wants to come in and apologize to you. Yeah, because they're not happy. Eight of wands. Yeah, they want to come in and communicate. Mm -mm. There's somebody who wants to talk to you. <clears throat> somebody could be listening to their intuition. They could be feeling like, you know, it's a, you know, it'd be a good idea if you go and, you know, make things right with that person, you know? Because that could be the reason why you're receiving karma. This was somebody who was there for you. They was riding with you, you know? I feel like you was down for whatever with this person. Also, with the hangman to the death card to the sun card in reverse. I mean, the hangman with the death card in reverse and the sun card in reverse. It's like somebody want to have somebody stuck in a situation, right? Keep them stuck. Don't want them to move on. Okay, with the death card in reverse, afraid of them moving on. But with the sun card in reverse, this person is not happy. That's like, especially you spared you, like, that's like literally like going up against yourself. Like, you don't, you, you, like, who want to ignore their intuition like that? It'll be like basically putting somebody else before you. 
It is always you first before anybody, anybody, because if you ain't right, nobody around you going to be right. Somebody wanted something not to change, you know, just to have you stuck, but you wasn't happy. Seven of Wands in reverse, somebody wanted you to let your guard down. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I know you know I'm starting drama. You know, I, you know I'm a player. You know I got options. But just wait. Just wait when I, you know, until I get it right. Put your guard down. Put your guard down. Ooh, child. Possibly could have tried to sacrifice you. Because your, your, your energy is too different from this person. And because it didn't work out, this person holds a grudge against you. It's like somebody wanted, with this shine? I, mean, I said shine. With this sun? Well, yeah, shine. Shine, your light irritates this person's demons. It's like with this with the sun card in reverse, it's like somebody wanted to take out your light. It, it was it was too much. It said your light irritates their demons. Somebody wanted that light to go out. You hear me? But anyway, the sun card was clarified with the page of cups. This person, um, they want to apologize now. Mm-hmm. They want to apologize. They want to talk to you. They want to take some type of action because they said they made a I've made up my mind. I'm not wasting any more time. This person made a decision. Yeah, and then they choose you. Somebody feel like you all they need. That you know, that it is what it is. You know. <clears throat> yeah, proceed with cautious and five of swords. And I feel like that's what the hell you did. You realized that somebody was jealous. You know, they was jealous. The chariot. Cancer energy. Yeah, I feel like you started moving forward. It's like somebody took a look at somebody and and, and, and they seen it like plain plain in sight. Like this person, they not good for me. They not good for me. Can I have a card on the seven of wands in reverse? Like somebody wanted you to let your guards down, even though you wasn't happy, even though you felt stuck. Okay, you know, just just let your guard down. Seven seven, something was cautioning you. Two sevens here, red flags. That's why we see proceed with caution because somebody was secretly jealous of you. What's the seven of wands in reverse? Now, Sunsi, this could be anybody to you guys, romantic. Family, friends, see how it resonates, you know, how it applies to your story. But the seven of wands in reverse is clarified with the knight of cups. Like, yeah, just let your guard down in this relationship. Somebody, I'm telling you, Sunsea, somebody was talking about you and went to other options and other people because your spirituality, I'm telling you, they knew you would be able to see through them. That was the whole thing. It's not like they don't, they, you know, I don't know. Maybe they, they, they don't like spiritual people. But I feel like it just has something to do with you being spiritual with this person. Because they knew that you would see right through them. You are just, you are, the, look, shine. Your light. You are the light. You will see, the light can see through the dark anytime. The dark is, the dark is dark. The dark trying to find the light. The dark, you can't see nothing in the dark. You trying to get to the light. But whoever you are, you are the light. So it's easy for you to see the darkness right away. Somebody wanted to put your light out. The seven of wands in reverse of the knight of cups. No, just stay in this relationship. Let your guard down. Like, ignore your intuition. Like somebody, somebody felt like you was above them and they wanted you to be beneath them. I feel like you should be beneath me. You know what? High priest is under the body. I'm not. High Priestess of the Queen of Pentacles. No. I feel like Six of Wands. Yes. You know your worth. Queen of Pentacles to the High Priestess. I feel like you know your worth. And you damn sure trust your intuition. Yeah. Six of Wands. It was all about the success. And the victory and the accolades. All of that you was getting. This person was intimidated. This person doesn't like the fact. It says, I get intimidated and nervous knowing you get so much attention. That should be. You should be. You should be feeling like, all right, that's what's up. You know? My man or my woman, they get a lot of attention. All right, so who, who, who cares? You know? As long as it ain't coming in between our connection. All right, oh well. That's a good thing. All right, so. Long as they ain't disrespecting our connection, disrespecting me, 
then that's fine. Okay, that's, that's fine. <laughs> Please. Six of Cups, okay? So whoever this person is from your past, so this could be all past related. This is definitely somebody who shared past life relationship, um, um, past life connection with that's reminiscing about you, that um, wants to come in and reconcile with you. Eight of Cups, okay? Yeah. Eight of Cups and a Nine of Cups. This is somebody who walked away from you. Mm-hmm. Somebody feel like they walked away from their wish fulfillment. Eight of Pentacles to the Justice. Mm-hmm. Now somebody want to come in and work on things with you. Why? Because they're getting karma. Mm-hmm. They're getting karma. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it's all because they feel like what they did to their wish fulfillment. They feel like you're moving on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Eight of Swords. Uh-huh. Somebody thought they was going to have you trapped. They was going to have you trapped, feeling stuck. Okay? Ten of Swords in reverse. This is you. You don't pull ten swords out your back. Okay? Whatever it is, whatever this heartbreak that this person did, you know you escaped it. You pulled yourself together. Um, you learning from your you learning from your past mistakes, you learning from your hardships. Um I feel like even with fear, even if you had fear in you, you still kept going. Okay? You still kept going. Yeah. Eight of swords to the ten of swords in reverse. Yeah, you you dealt with a you dealt with a I heard this person did a double on you. If I know it's you. This person put you through it. And like I said, with that Emperor to the Ten of Cups, I feel like you didn't give up easily on this person. You kept giving this person chance after chance after chance. Six of Pentacles. Okay, trying to give to this person. Yes, yes. Six of Pentacles, yes to the Empress. You kept trying to give to this person. Fight for this connection. Be generous to this person. You know, some of you guys will be even extra generous. So, because you knew this person was hating, you know, just to try to make this person feel like, you know, um, things are fair. You know, you don't got to worry. You know, I know, you know, it's like some of you guys, you knew how this person felt. So, you'll be extra generous to try to make this person feel comfortable. But nothing you can do will ever satisfy this person. And Spirit is like, no, don't do that. Don't dim your light. Don't dim your light because somebody else is mad that your light is irritating their demons. So, they want to talk shit on you because they broke ass, couldn't sit with you. When you was trying to get them, you was, you was, you was, you was preparing a seat right here. Okay? Because Empress, Emperor, whoever you choose is the Emperor or the Empress. You know? As long as they ain't the upright doing the right thing, they can become the emperor or the empress. But this is somebody who did they they just refused to change. They didn't want to be they didn't want to be the emperor or the empress. They wanted to come and steal seven of swords. They wanted to come and steal from an emperor or empress. They didn't want to put in the work. Oh child. Yeah. But spirit said, uh-huh. Yeah. This person is doing bad. I'm telling you, doing bad. Okay. <clears throat> and this person is still watching you win. Yeah, I said doing back here, making up King of Pentacles in reverse. Spirit, you know what? Ooh, child. I said this, but I said this. Y'all heard me. This person is doing bad. I knew what I was feeling. King of Pentacles in a goddamn reverse. This person is having money problems. They are not grounded. They are not stable. Um, there's somebody who was coming in to steal. They didn't want to work for it. Okay. There's someone who would do anything. It's like, and I don't know why I picked up on the energy where you guys would like probably be over generous to this person because you knew that this, I heard, wow. You knew this person was a hater on the law. You knew it. So you would try to get this person to feel okay you know, so they, you know, make them feel good. But it was nothing you could do for this person because this person wanted everything. They wanted everything. They wanted everything you built. They wanted it. They wanted it for themselves. But it's the same person that was a spiritual hater. You know what? Yeah, four cups. Now they in regret. Mm-hmm. They in regret. They regret losing you with the seven of cups. This person is all in their head. Seven, seven, seven. Because you're a winner. You're a winner. Somebody feels like they lost their wish fulfillment. Three of cups to the queen of wands. Mm -hmm. The page of wands. Yeah, you, and you're very attractive. Yeah. They see you celebrating. They see you happy. Queen of Wands to the Page of Wands, you is beautiful as hell. Okay? Or handsome. 
<laughs> okay? Very, very, very attractive. And that's the problem. I get intimidated and nervous knowing you get so much attention. Now, everybody knows the Queen of Wands cannot even help it, okay? They cannot help that. That's just natural. That they can't help that. That's something that this person will have to take up with God because you didn't have, you didn't have nothing to do with it. That's how God made you. Oh, child. Ten of Wands, Seven of Pentacles, King of Cups. Yeah, now this person is burdened. They burdened by whatever they invested in. What they put their time and their energy to. Yeah, Knight of Wands, out here being a player. Out here being a player, but now I'm feeling emotional over you. Mm-hmm. Thinking back about all the decisions that they had made, what they put their time and their energy to. Only to be feeling overlo overloaded and, and, and overwhelmed and burdened. Yeah, you don't do that to nobody. You don't do that to nobody. You do not do that to nobody. Yeah. Emperor. You don't do that to no emperor, no empress. <laughs> and for a lot of you guys, this was your divine counterpart. They had the potential to be an emperor or an empress. They did. They had the potential. Spirit said, I see divine union somewhere. Um, but yeah, they were just in this devil energy, this narcissist energy. Yeah. Um, Ace of Wands, possibly a lot of sex addictions. Sure. A lot of addictions. Okay. This is somebody with the, the devil to the, the, the Ace of Wands. That's a lustful ass spirit. A lustful, lustful, lustful. Page of Swords, and they watch you, and they wait, wait for you to return. Is you going to come back? Three of Swords, this person is hurt, and they worry. Something could have been going on for two years. Ace of Pentacles to the Lovers, to the Ten of Pentacles. Ooh, Nine of Pentacles. Ooh, Five of Pentacles. All right, Sunseed. So whoever you leaving out in the cold, okay? Spirit is saying Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles to the Lovers, the Ace of Pentacles. You made a choice. To walk away from this person. And now you're about to get a new opportunity. Mm -hmm. You could have got some. Um, this could be a new financial gain. Um, a new job. A new business. Um, money. Investments. Um, but with the lovers to the ace of pentacles. I feel like this is giving me like a new lover. Mm -hmm. Nine of pentacles to the ten of pentacles. Mm -hmm. I feel like you're very stable. You're very independent. And that's, and that's what it was. This person loves your independence. They love your independence. They love how stable you were. Mm -hmm. They love how stable you were. But you got to get some unexpected financial windfall. Okay? Yeah. Six of Swords. I feel like you were guided to, to hold back from this energy with the Four of Pentacles. Yeah, I told you. What did I tell you? Ace of Cups. You about to get new love. Ace of Pentacles to the Ace of Cups. Yeah, two of Pentacles in reverse. You ain't got to worry about nobody juggling you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That won't be happening. Yeah. Queen of Cups in reverse to the Queen of Swords. <laughs> Some of you guys have pulled all your feelings and emotions out of this. Okay? And a lot of you guys are in this Queen of Swords energy. Yeah. Now, if somebody juggled you, you know what? If somebody juggled you, it's like something backfired. But with the two of pentacles in reverse, I just feel like whoever I'm, whoever I'm picking up on, I feel like uh, this person is now lacking balance in their life since you left. Yeah, since you put your energy back, you don't have no more emotions, no feelings or nothing for this connection. Okay? You standing firm and, or, you know, and, and you know, you setting boundaries. Yeah, the star card. Yeah, the star card to the temperate. Mm-hmm. Yep. I feel like you and this balanced energy after healing. We've seen the Ten of Swords in reverse. Yeah. Now that you have healed, now that you have grown, um, now that you have worked through this energy, it's like you you feel like you got your, you know, your life is more balanced now. Life is more peaceful. Yeah. And now this person's feeling insecure because things are changing out in their life. Yeah. Ace of Swords, the Will of Fortune, the Magician to the Nine of Wands. Yeah. Things are changing. For what they did to you. <clears throat> Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, three of Pentacles in reverse. Fell out on competition. I get intimidated and nervous knowing you get a lot of attention. Three of Pentacles, yeah. Some of you guys are just not, you're not going to waste your time with this person. Uh, just don't want to work with this person. 
You feel like they gave you a lack of effort. It was just, they just started too much drama. Jeez. God damn. Just imagine you just trying to make it work and somebody just causing, like, oh, child. The higher prince of the nine of wands could have been insecure, but it could have been, you know, about have you know commitment issues. This could have been somebody who just didn't want to commit, you know, always giving you excuses after excuses because they was a player. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Anything else? Like somebody wants somebody to stay in a relationship they're not happy in, but then they don't want them to leave. They want to keep them stuck. Like, where do they do that at? The fool card in reverse. Yeah, this person feels foolish as hell now. They feel foolish. Yeah, page of pentacles in reverse. Okay, this person could be receiving some type of bad news. Okay, and they are oh, having money problems with the fool in reverse to the page of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, that's whoever the look. The, I think the king of pentacles in reverse somewhere up here. Yeah, it's like since you walked away from this person, they've been having money problems, or they could have been having money problems. Okay, it could have got a little bit. The money problems could have got a little bit better when you was in their life, but only because they was attached to your energy. But the moment you pulled your energy back, this person, the the, the fool and the page of pentacles in reverse, please. Okay? This person, you know what? I ain't playing with y'all, so I see. <laughs> I, I believe with y'all. Something could have been going on for six months. You could have been working on for something for six months. Something could have been happening for less than two years. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Something could have been going on for three years. Anything else? Family. My focus has been on my, my family. They mean the world to me. I feel like this is you guys' energy. You've been focused on your family. You know what matters to you the most. That nine of pinnacles, ten of pinnacles. Yeah, somebody else said regret. Regret. I regret walking away. I wish I knew what I know now. Yeah. Somebody, yeah, that's why we seen the um the eight of cups to the nine of cups. Yeah. Somebody walked away from their wish fulfillment. Yeah. Trust the plan. Unchange. Yeah, this person was this person didn't want to change. So you had to you had to stay focused. Now whoever this, this play is, they want it says practice forgiveness. They want your forgiveness. Mm-hmm. And in the past, they was holding a grudge against you because somebody felt like, you know what, somebody felt like you left them behind. Like, if you were supposed to tolerate their actions, yeah. Wants you back. This person wants you back. And they tripping on you. Wants you back. Tripping on you. Yeah, low IQ. Nightmares. Yeah. This person was not dealing with a full deck. Up into upstairs. Yeah, child neglect. This could be somebody who was like, you know, a bad, you know, bad parenting. Um, not there for the kids. Um, somebody who's just selfish, okay? Very selfish, very mean. This also gives me someone who was just childish as hell because we see the Page of Pentacles and the Fool card in reverse, somebody who was very childish. And they extra triggered. You trigger the hell out of this person, okay? Karmic friends. So they could have been listening to karmic friends about you. You know, maybe the, the karmic friends were telling them, you know, oh, just do this, do that, do that. Yeah, well... They realize on karmic friends they should have listened to because now somebody wants to come in and cheat you. Mm hmm. Whew. But since I'm about to tap out of this reading, <laughs> okay. I hope this reading was able to help you guys, give you guys clarity on your situation. Okay. Anything you need to know about me will be in the description box. It looks like if you if you went through anything with this person to wear. You know, obviously, we could see where you had to pull them 10 swords out your back where it was real painful. And the death card in reverse, like somebody was just refusing to change. If you thought you was going through when you had to pull them 10 swords out your back, ooh, I feel like this person going through it 10 times worse, okay? The emperor to the devil, that's a narc. That's a narcissist, okay? Yeah. And when they couldn't control you the way they wanted to control you, okay, they went and talked about you. Mm -hmm. They went and talked about you to everyone. It's like somebody wanted to control control you, control your money, control your foundation, control everything that you built on your own. Nine of Pentacles, that is somebody who's independent, built something from the ground up, out the mud, by themselves. Somebody just went haywire. They started talking about you. 
Yeah. <clears throat> but things are changing. <clears throat> this person could be experiencing some type of bad news when it comes to the legal um the legal system. But spirit is saying things are being balanced out. I'm hearing that's just the way it is. Things will never be the same. Mm. All right, Sun Steeds. I love you. I love you. I love you guys so very much. I'm going to come on here a little later, Sun Steeds. All right. We're going to um, we gonna switch it on. Let's see. We're going to pull some other decks. See what the energy is going on. Hopefully, it changed. Okay. You know, energy is constantly changing, okay? Five minutes ago, ten minutes ago, an hour ago could be the past, you know? Energy is constantly changing, okay? So, let's see. I love you, Sussie. <laughs> Later.